job feature or jobs page. The job feature allows you to create a job portal inside your app should you require to. It's very simple. We've got the feature settings. There's obviously you can change the app icon as per all the other features. You can change the name to something specific, jobs available or we are hiring or something like that. You can see it immediately changes it up there. And then you've got a couple of options. The first one is display search. So that will allow you to display a search function so people can search for jobs. Display a place icon, which will display where those jobs are. In other words, people can search in geographic locations and it will display income or the amount pay payable. It will also display a contact that allows users to apply for the job from within the application. Once again, we can change the background should we so require. And then, of course, we need to be able to load jobs. So the first thing we need to load in order to load jobs is we need to add a company where we will have to add in all this information. My com company. A description on the company. A website, email. You have to put an email address in for where the job applications will be submitted to. You have to put an address, 23. Uh, you don't need to put this. You can put administrators, website, and current employee count and stuff like that in. Let's just see if I've got a logo here somewhere that we can quickly upload. That's your company logo that will be shown on the job. And then a header. For the specific company. And then uh, we'll just use the global configuration for the display. Okay. And there we go. Now we've created a company. Once the company has been created, you'll see that there's positions available and there's categories. So let's add a category. Marketing. We can put a description of the category. Uh, um, and then we can put an icon for the category. If we have a specific icon, if we don't. And there we go. And we can add keywords. So that would be for the search function. Once somebody searches for a job, those keywords will be used to direct them to the correct jobs. Okay, so now we've added a company and we've added a category. Now we can start loading positions. So you don't need to put in an icon if you don't want. You don't need to put in a header if you don't want. But I'll put a nice header in. Uh, then we can put a job title, work on the beach. You can put a description in, contact email if it's different from the company email. It's probably a good idea to put it in anyway. Or if you want all applications to go to a specific email, this is where you'll put that in. The company, since we only have one company, we'll, uh, it'll allow us to pick that one. If we had more than one company listed, it will give us a drop-down list where we can choose the company. Same with the category. We're going to put it in the marketing category. Contract type, three months. Income from 5000 to 10,000 or 500. Oh, there we go. Income from. So there we put the minimum and there we put the maximum. And then once again, keywords if we want to. 
and okay and we have loaded our first job so what we will see when we go to the left over here we will see work on the beach do something while do some marketing while surfing and it's for my company it will bring up the header image that you added and the rest of the information on there and they can click on contact put their details in and the message and submit it straight away uh, they can click on company and get more information on the company and positions offered by the company and there you go that's pretty much a complete job portal that you can build into your app for your customers